Hi, I'm Mr. Money. Welcome back to another Grand Theft Auto 5 online video. Uh, guys, in today's video, we're going to be looking for that rare stone hatchet. I'll put a picture up on screen of what it looks like, although we're going to be getting it in just a little bit. But I'll put a picture on screen so you guys can see what it looks like uh, kind of in detail. Um, I didn't actually realize it came out this morning. Today is Friday, and I, I, I didn't even know it came out. I looked on my phone. I was just kind of chilling here. Looked on my phone, and people were making videos about it. So I was just like, is this clickbait, or is this actually out? And it was actually out in the game. So I was like, yo, I got to make a video about it. We got to go get that thing, because I like killing people, and that's just a new weapon to kill people with. So I guess what you have to do is you'll get messages on your in-game phone I guess you have, I, I'm pretty sure you had to be outside your apartment uh, people said you had to be outside your apartment I wasn't for sure but I've been I've been pretty much chilling in my apartment for the last five minutes and haven't gotten a single message so I'm gonna head outside I'm gonna drive around waiting for that message that the guy will send us uh, he pretty much is just gonna tell us if you want to accept the mission and then he'll send us more uh, messages about people we have to go kill I think there's five in total and then after we kill all five people then we get to go find the hatchet and then we get the hatchet and then we get to kill people that's basically what we're doing. I'm going to drive around, I'm going to wait for his message, and I'll let you guys know when it arrives. Okay, guys, so we just got the message. I pretty much just had it outside. It's it's from Mod. I'm going to call him Mod. I don't really know what that is. But I guess he's just asking us. I'm pretty sure what we're supposed to do is just go on to the message here. Like, you have to officially go on to it. Yep, it says Mod will be in touch soon with details on the first bounty target. Ooh, bounties. I love killing bounties. Everybody knows that. Okay, cool. So now I guess we just wait uh, for him to send another message. And it pretty much tell us where the bounty is, and then we'll get like a picture, and then we'll have to go to the area, find the guy, and kill him. That's basically what we're doing, so let's wait for that. Just as a little side note, I do want to make it really, really clear to you guys, just in case you guys can't really figure it out why you can't accept the mission. When you get the message, make sure you pull up your phone, you go into messages, you go to the message and get on it, so that way you can look at it. Like, you can scroll down with it on your D-pad. As long as you're able to do this with the message, then you will be able to accept the uh, mission, okay? I just want to make sure that that's clear, so no one's confused or anything like that. Alright, let's wait for the other messages. Okay, guys, so I wasn't really paying attention, but we just got the message from it. It'll be in the emails uh, from him. It'll be right in here, the first bounty target. Here we go. So we have to look for... How do we look through it? Okay, we got to go down with the D-pad. We have to look for this lady probably in that little location they're giving us. Uh, right here. So let's go into this location. We have to look for that lady and then probably kill her and shoot her in the face, which I am completely okay with. <laughs> All right, guys, we're here. Now we're just going to have to keep a lookout for this woman. I'll let you know if I find her. All right, guys, so I just ordered my Deluxo. I want to give this a try. I want to see what happens if I put on my lock-on missiles and see if I fly around the sky. It'll probably work with a buzzard as well. I remember during, like, CEO missions and stuff like that, this would work for, uh, like, these hidden-type areas. So I don't know if this will work, but I'm going to fly around and see if I can lock onto anything. And then if we lock onto something, it's probably her. So I'm just going to try this real quick. I'll let you guys know if it works. Alright guys, so I didn't lock onto her, but I did fly over her, so this I, I feel like is a good method to work. Just fly over the areas, so that way you're not walking everywhere, because I just I just kind of flew over. It didn't lock onto her or anything, it just kind of flew over. So I guess just get your Deluxo or a helicopter and just kind of fly over the area pretty much everywhere, cover the map, and then you're all good. Alright, we just killed her. So now what do we get? The bounty target was killed, we get $5,000, sweet. Okay, so now I'm pretty sure there's five of them, but now we have to wait, of course, for the next one. So I'm just going to fly around here, and I'm going to wait for the next one to get to my phone. Alright guys, so we just got our next mission right here, uh, so let's go onto our phone, we go to emails, and then we have it right here. Alright, this is our second bounty target, let's see what he looks like, oh my god, he looks creepy. He looks like a stalker or something like that. Alright, let's go find him. Let's see here, where we gotta go on the map, oh my god, is it all the way out here? It's all the way out here, so we're gonna have a little bit of a journey, but it'll be worth it, because we get a pretty cool hatchet. Alright guys, we are here, so like I said last time, I'm just gonna fly over the area and see if I spot him, yep, I did right there guys, there he is. Alright, cool. So I don't know if these locations are the same for everyone, if she'll be kind of like standing in the same location or he will be standing in the same location. But if he is, and this is exactly where it is in this location all the way out here, you're gonna die, man. Okay, you, you wanna fight? Oh my god! <laughs> you wanna fight, bro? Let's go! <laughs> Let's go! You little jerk. I wonder how much life he has, man. People people know him normally would have died. This guy's a creeper. He's a creeper. He doesn't just die easy. Can I have his bat? Cool, I'll take his bat. Cool. Have this and, uh, what is he doing? Bounty will surrender and follow you. Take them to... Okay, let's do it. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know what's happening. So we can take him to the M and collect our reward. Alright, let's do it, guys. Let's take him to the M. Screw it. I don't know if we could do this with the last one or if this is just with the second one, but let's see what we get. Alright, guys, we are at the M. Let's see what we get for this. I don't know if this you can do this with all the people, but if you can, I recommend if you want to do this. I'm assuming you get extra money. Uh, beat the crap out of them, <laughs> and then they'll surrender. So that's what I recommend doing. Uh, let's see here. I'm assuming people don't really want to do this, though, because it takes a little bit of time, but I'll take time to get more money. See how much we get. 
$10,000. So if you want an extra $5,000, I'm pretty sure if you kill them, you get $5,000, which we got the first time. And if you trade them in, you get $10,000. So if you want an extra $10,000, uh, out of all of this, you can probably make a good $50,000 because there's five targets. So you can make $50,000 or $25,000, depending on whether or not you just want to kill them or you want to bring them in. So that's up to you. Uh, definitely the the uh, hover vehicle, this uh, uh, the Deluxo, definitely works 100%. I if you have one of these, use it. If you have a helicopter, use it. Just fly over the area pretty low and then it just pretty much notices them there and it shows them on the map. So that's kind of cool. All right, I am going to wait for the next message. And All right, guys, I got the next message. Let's see who we have to go shoot. Uh, here we go. Third bounty target. Uh, he looks creepy. Looks like he's going to hurt me. All right, let's go look for him. Let's see where there he is. Uh, right here. We're right next to it. Let's head over there and let's shoot him in the face. All right, guys, here we go. Same thing as last time. I'm just going to hover over the area. Exactly what I recommend you guys do and see if we can see him. All right, there he is, guys. This method definitely works 100% through this because it literally took me two seconds. Hey, what's up, bro? So for the sake of this video not taking forever, I'm just going to shoot him because uh, I want him dead. <laughs> I don't really want to turn him in. I'm just going to shoot him in the face. All right, cool. I'll take the $5,000. I'm cool with that. Is he dead? Yeah, he's dead. All right, cool. Now let's wait for the next message. All right, guys. We just got the next message. We got the fourth bounty to kill. Let's see what he looks like and see where we're going. Uh, okay. He looks kind of creepy, but he looks okay. He looks okay out of all of them. Uh, where are we going? Are we going back to the city? Of course we're going back to the city. Long drive. Alright, let's head to the pier. Alright guys, we are here. So I'm going to do the exact same thing. I'm just going to fly over and hope I see him. Alright guys, there he is guys. I just found him. This actually took me a while to find. I couldn't find him for a while there. I, flew, I even flew over this spot, but I didn't lock onto him. So if you guys have the pier location, this is where he is right now. Ah! He's going to stab me! <laughs> do it. Don't do it, you little jerk. Alright guys, that is the fourth one. Now we have to wait for the fifth, and I'm pretty sure final one. Alright, let's wait for that message. Alright guys, so we just got a next message that says, well, this is my only name left on the list. That means he's probably the last person. I was right. There's only five people. Uh, let's see here. What do we got? What do we got? Oh god, he looks like he's gonna kill me. Okay. Let's figure out where we gotta search for him. Uh, where is it? Oh, that's all the way out here, isn't it? Oh, you jerks. I was just out there. Alright, let's head on out there. Alright guys, we are approaching the area. I'm assuming he'll be right here where that last guy is. I, I don't know that for a fact, but I'm just going to check right here first, make sure. Uh, let's see here. Nope, he's not right there. So he's not at the first location where that first guy was. Oh, maybe, that, is that him? Is this him? No, that's not him. That's not him. Alright, we're going to do it like we did before. We're just going to fly over the whole entire city and wait to uh, wait for it to lock onto him. Alright guys, there he is. He's just kind of <laughs> chilling down here in this little ditch area. I don't exactly know what he's doing, but uh, I'm just going to shoot him right in his face real quick. What are you doing? He's just lounging right here. He's just lounging. Sorry, man. Had to happen. I need my money. I want the hatchet. Sorry, bro. All right, there we go. We did it. So now how do we get the hatchet? I'm assuming we get some type of message or something, or is it on the map? I don't know, I don't know how to get the hatchet. Um, I, I'm going to wait for a message. I'm assuming we'll get some type of message, and she'll tell us where it is. That's what I'm assuming is going to happen. Or I'll wait until I find out. Oh, here's the message. Okay, here we go. Um, so is it on the map? Uh, oh, there it is. Okay, so it's, it's you just wait a couple seconds and she sends you a message and then you get to go over here and you get your treasure chest. All right, I'm going to head over there. I'll see you guys when we get there. All right, guys, we are here. Time to see whether or not all these missions were worth the hassle. See if this thing is worth it. I'm pretty sure it's going to be. It looks pretty dope from what I've seen from the pictures. Where is it? How do I how do I get it? I don't see it. Um, right here? Is that it? Oh, that's the box right there. It's so it's so dark out. I can't see anything. Turn, turn around. Turn around. Open it. All right, here we go, guys. Here we go. Hey, there it is. This thing looks dope. Is there like a feather on it? Yeah. I like it, guys. I think it's pretty dope. Definitely worth the definitely worth all of it. You know, it took some time. It took me about 40 minutes to get all of this done. I mean, just the wait time of waiting for the messages to come took absolutely forever. Hold on, let's go in first person look at this thing. Yeah, I like it. Whack. Can you imagine going up to a player and be like, yo, you stole my money. Whack. <laughs> this thing is definitely pretty cool. It says get 25 kills with a stone hatch to unlock GTA Online, uh, GTA 5 Online money reward and exclusive access to this weapon in uh, Red Dead Redemption 2. I might be buying that game, not for sure, but you definitely get money. Uh, I'm assuming you'll probably get a good $200,000 or something like that. Uh, I'll be finding out in our next video that I'll be posting tomorrow because uh, what you can do to get your kills, you can go up and down the streets of Los Santos. I recommend going to like the beach, the pier, somewhere around there, uh, all the way through here, like Hollywood Boulevard type places, um, the beach, the airport. Anywhere where there's a bunch of people, just uh, go up and down the streets, kill 25 people. It'll give you even a little counter, and it'll tell you how many people you've killed. Uh, I'm going to take a little bit more of a challenge with it, though. I'm going to try and kill 25 different players in our next video, which is going to be posted tomorrow. I'm going to go for that, and I'll let you guys know how that goes, because uh, I'm assuming it'll be probably be pretty hard. But I'm going to go for it. I'm going to see what happens. All right, guys, if you guys like the video, may press the like button. If not, that's cool. And if you guys really like the video, may press the subscribe button. If not, that's cool, too. It's completely up to you. I will talk to you guys in the next video. Bye!